boy who has spent his entire life undergoing surgeries and rehabilitation for a rare genetic disorder is now at home for the first time. Francesco Bruno was released from La Robita Children's Hospital today. WGN Sean Lewis is more on his future care and the excitement of his siblings. At La Robita Children's Hospital, inside cabin 17, Francesco Bruno, almost three years old, waits for his big day. That's because for the first time in his young life, he's going to be leaving the hospital for home. For the last couple of weeks, every hour has felt like years. His dad and mom today optimistic and nervous for what lies ahead. We've been waiting for him to come home for a long time. We've been trying to get him home for a long time, but it didn't really materialize and, and, and it wasn't really confirmed until very recently. Francesco is the youngest of seven kids, born with a genetic disorder called skeletal dysplasia. It means that his rib cage would not grow properly to accommodate his growing lungs. Because of that, he has undergone several surgeries to expand his ribs and allow him to thrive and develop to where he is today. Much of his life, though, has been spent on a respirator and feeding tube. Only recently has he been able to start to talk and laugh out loud. His smile, his warmth. Over the last year and a half, Francesco's care team at La Robita has witnessed his courage. It's a delight to watch him and it's a delight to see him, like, you know, playing around with his iPad and grow and develop. After weeks of training mom and dad on the nearly round the clock care that Francesco needs, we do ask these families to do a lot at home. Today Yay, is go home day for Francesco. For the first time, he will be with all of his brothers and sisters. They're at home, you know, making cards and waiting for the phone call for us to tell them we're on our way. It is a homecoming for a little boy who has never stopped fighting, his family driven by faith. The fact that we're even standing here almost three years later still talking about him is already, you know, it's a miracle in itself. What made us get through this has been faith. And now that he is home, there is still a very long road ahead for Francesco and his family as they work nearly round the clock to make sure that he does have the care, that he is happy and healthy for what lies ahead. On the city's south side at La Robita Children's Hospital, Sean Lewis, WGN News.